Hi, thanks for joining me for VChat today. I love Rube Goldberg machines, watching them in action. You know what they are? These are these contraptions where there are a whole bunch of steps and one thing is knocking something else and so a ball rolls down and it hits something else and eventually the final process is achieved. But of course, sometimes they don't work, right? Something goes wrong and it doesn't happen the way it's supposed to. One of the most effective advertisements in history was called the COG. It was advertising the Honda Accord. It has just a series of car parts moving along and each car part hits another and eventually at the very end, um, the final part hits a trailer, the trailer tips over and the Honda Accord rolls off and there's this line, isn't it nice when things just work? Well, yes, it's nice when things just work. Paul doesn't use the idea of a Rube Goldberg machine in his talking about the workings of a church, but he does use the analogy of a body. Every part of a body is useful and necessary. If you had eyes without ears, things wouldn't happen. If you didn't have arms, you wouldn't be able to do things. For a fully effective body to be functioning, it needs to have every part working. And he goes on and says that the Holy Spirit has given each one of us spiritual gifts so that we can work within the body of Christ, serving one another and helping everyone to be able to have what we need as the body of Christ to have everything working just right. We'll be talking about that on Sunday, the idea of the body of Christ and the spiritual gifts that the Holy Spirit gives to each one of us. This Sunday is also a Sunday where we celebrate with the Korean church that will be with us. We'll be having a potluck after the service. Please come for the service. Please come for the potluck afterwards. We'll have a lot of fun together. Thanks so much, and I'll see you again next week. Bye for now. Isn't it nice when things just work?